Let's talk about bridging, because this comment keeps coming up. What is bridging, and how is it any different from combining your internet connections through bonding, like Speedify? So if you go to the control panel and then click on network and internet, and then network and sharing center, and then over on the side, click change adapter settings. If you connect to two networks at the same time, like I talked about in my last video, you'll see them both show up in here. You can actually click and drag, highlight them, right click, and bridge connections and it'll create this new adapter called Network Bridge, which appears to combine the two connections and it shows up as a new ethernet adapter in the task manager. This looks like it's combining your connections to the internet, but it's not. We've created a new adapter that acts as a local bridge between these two connections. It means the networks on each adapter are able to talk to each other through your computer. So for example, if your computer has internet access, through one of those adapters, it can share it with devices connected to the other network. Your computer has no idea how to route traffic over those two connections in a way that's beneficial to your internet connection. Doing this will not increase the speed or the reliability of your internet in any way, and it can actually make your connection worse from interference issues. Bonding, on the other hand, can increase the speed and reliability of your internet connections. So bonding, unlike bridging, can actually increase bandwidth and or provide redundancy because it's splitting the traffic at the packet level and intelligently routing it through each connection and then merging it back together on each end. Like and follow for more connectivity technology knowledge.